Hey everybody, it's Tristan and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I am here bringing you guys a very quick and easy, simple makeup tutorial for back to school. Now listen, well first of all, I just got my hair done, I got a perm and like I had one like a month and a half ago, like if you could tell it was like wavy. Um, so I got one again just like revamp it because it has kind of come out and as of right now it's not styled or anything, it's just there so it's kind of looking a mess, so just ignore that it's fine like we're gonna survive anyways back on topic i know about 99 percent of you who are going back to school probably are not that thrilled about it but listen we've all had to do it lucky for me i already graduated so i paid my dues to society so i'm i'm good but for those of you who aren't and had to continue going to school yes it sucks but if you're gonna be sitting in that classroom for eight hours a day for the next i don't know like eight months, eight or nine or something like that, you might as well do it looking good. So yeah, without any further ado, let's get on with the tutorial. And by the way, this was inspired by James Charles. Um, He did one of these, I think like a few days ago or something like that. So I decided that I would do one too. And the main difference between ours is that mine's gonna be better. I'm kidding, that was a joke. Don't come for me in the comments. Please, thank you, and that is all. Alrighty guys, so first off, we're gonna go in with primer. And today I'm gonna be using my Gucci primer. Now you do not have to use something this bougie like honestly any primer that works for your skin will work and also I am actually in the market for a new primer something that is good for oily skin so if there's a primer out there that you guys like to use that is good for oily skin because that's what I got um definitely leave a comment down below of what you guys like to use because I'm in the market for a new one. I'm just curious as to what else is out there. Alrighty next we're gonna go in with concealer first I know this is kind of like backwards but that's what we're gonna do we're gonna take a concealer that is our own skin tone not lighter than and we're gonna take that and we're just going to put that under our eyes just to really make sure that our dark circles and blemishes are concealed see I have a kind of patch of disgusting right around here and something right around there so we got to get rid of that and then we're gonna take our damp beauty blender and we're just going to buff that out And there we go. Alrighty, next we're gonna go in with foundation and today I am using two foundations and I'm gonna do a combination of the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation in the shade Nude Ivory. And then I'm gonna be going in with the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Pro Matte Foundation in the shade 102. And my friend Sarah, she actually showed me this combination. She used it on me when she was just doing my makeup for fun and I really liked it, so. That's what I tend to use more often than not. And I'll do my forehead as soon as I can like move my hair out of the way, so. And while I do like these foundations, the only problem really that I have with the Wet n Wild foundation is that it kind of smells like straight up paint. Like, not gonna lie, that's the, that's the true tea on that. But you know, it works. And then you're gonna take your damp beauty blender once again and just blend that out. Wow, on screen we are looking very, very white. But you know what, maybe I just come across as that freaking pale, who knows. Alrighty guys, and once you have your foundation all on and beautiful, we're gonna go in with some concealer that is lighter than our skin tone, just to highlight a few areas of our face. There are dogs barking outside for some reason, so that's fun. And then we're just going to blend that out as well. Wow, I look so washed out. Oh, by the way, the concealers that I've been using are um the NARS concealer right there. Just so you know, I for the one that was my skin tone, I went in with shade, what was it? Uh, light 2.5, and then for the one that was lighter than my skin tone, I went in with shade light 1. Alrighty, and now to set all of that, we're gonna go in with our Laura Mercier translucent powder and just pack that on under our eyes and in any problem areas that we have. So I'm gonna go in between my eyebrows. I have all kinds of problems up in there. And then we're gonna go around the nose. And I just got white powder all over my black outfit. I'm so smart, guys. Let me tell you what. what. That was horrifying. I'm sorry. Alrighty, in all honesty, right now, I'm literally looking like a ghost. So that needs to be fixed, like, right now. Um, so we're gonna bronze. Oh my gosh. Okay, I look, I look like a legit ghost. Okay, we're gonna bronze ASAP, like, right now. We're gonna go in with the Skinny Dip Palette from Kylie Jenner's, uh, 
vacation collection and we're gonna go in with the bronzer out of there called Sunkissed. What a beautiful name. I actually really like this bronzer. So we're just going to um, bring some life back to our face so we don't look literally dead because that's where we're headed right now. There we go, I think that's helping, maybe a little. Will the camera just work? Will this just focus? Come on. Why are we being washed out? Why is this happening? There we go, I think that helped us out quite a bit. Now I know when you're in school, you're basically dead inside, but we don't wanna like look like we're dead inside. You feel me? We wanna look better than everyone else there. And to do that, we have to have like, I don't know, some color to our skin, maybe just a little bit. And I know you can't really see my forehead, but we're still gonna hit it. See from a distance, from like back like this, we look more bronze. So I'm just gonna stand back like this forever, okay? You don't wanna see me up too close anyways. Alrighty, once we're all bronzed up a bit, we are going to go in with some highlight, like everybody's favorite part, basically. And, hmm. Oh, I just zoomed in and that helped a lot. Alrighty, well anyways, for highlight today, we're gonna be going in with the Jeffree Star Cosmetics and Manny MUA Collaboration Highlighter in the shade Eclipse. It's a beauty, y'all, let me tell ya. And it's sold out right now on his website. You might be able to get it somewhere else though. If you go into the FAQ on Jeffrey's website, I'm, I'm sure you'll be able to find it. Oh, hello, hello. It's me. That's a dead meme, but it's okay. Still a good song. And if you're wondering, yes, I am applying this with a blending brush because uh, I like the more compact brushes like this for highlight. It shows up a lot more and I don't have one like compact that's meant for highlight, so I just use a blending brush. You work with what you got. Alrighty, and next we're gonna do some brows, and we're just gonna do like a light brow, nothing too extreme, so we're gonna go in with our Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz in the shade A Dark Brown. So we're just gonna flick up a little, and we're just gonna do a little fill-in. Nothing too extreme, but enough to where you can notice that they're better than they were. And boom, I think those are good. Alrighty, now in James, mm, I'm dropping things. Lovely. So in James, mm, okay. Can we not just do anything right anymore? Is this, is this what it's gonna be? We're this zoomed in now. Okay, so in James Charles tutorial, he said that we just didn't have time for um, eyeshadow, but listen, you do if you hurry, so we're gonna hurry. Cause I want a little bit of definition in my crease, you feel? Okay, I hope you feel because that's what's happening right now. So we're gonna go in with this little Morphe palette. It's just full of a lot of really neutral colors. And we're gonna go in with this shade. Oh, which one do we wanna go in with? We're just gonna go in with this one right here, this little moment. Nothing too crazy. And we're just gonna hop that right in there and just blend out. Alrighty, and next we're gonna go in with, oh, what do I want? We're gonna go in with this little color right here, depth. And we're just gonna blend that out. This is just for the sake of wanting to be a little bit extra, but not like too extra. Like we're not doing some crazy eye. We're just adding a little bit of definition here. Kind of also just to balance out the brows because those are very prominent. And then we're gonna go in with this darker color right here. We're just gonna dab in and we're gonna blend that out as well. And then once you have all that done up there, we're just gonna drag it down a little bit like so, just to even out just a little bit. There we go, nothing too extreme, but you know what? Girl, it's effective. Just adds a little oomph to whatever's going on over here. Alrighty, and lastly for the eyes, in terms of eyeshadow, we're gonna add a little bit of shimmer on the lid, Not nothing crazy. But we're gonna just take our finger and we're gonna swirl around in this little shimmer shade right here. And we're just gonna pop that on our lid. And this is just a very soft shimmer, like, it's shimmery, but it's nothing like crazy at all. And there we go. See James, we have time if we hurry. See, I don't think that took too long, but you know what? To each their own, you do you. And pardon me, I do wanna add just a little bit of brow highlight, just some. Um, ignore me here, just gonna pop that in under there. Sorry, this might take a little bit extra time. You can skip this step if you want. You do you, but I wanted it. All right, next we're gonna do lashes. And personally, I really enjoy my um, roller lash from Benefit, not sponsored. None of this is sponsored, what am I saying? Um, but yeah, I like this, so I'm using it. And we're just gonna take this and try not to get it on our lid, cause if we do, I'm gonna literally die. I'm just gonna do that. And we are gonna coat our lashes. Bada boom. Oh, I really like that lash. Oh, there we go. And we 
Let's hit the lower ones. Beautiful. Glorious. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to curl them. Oh well. You know what you say when that happens? <gasps> maybe tomorrow. Because we don't have time to turn back. I mean, maybe I could curl them with the mascara on. Do I care? Nope. Um, lashes are done. I'm surprised I actually just like got it on my lashes and they look good without me um, getting them all over my face. That happens sometimes. And last, but certainly not least, guys, this is like my favorite part of any look. I am a lipstick whore. I love lipstick. I have so many. Now, guys, um, with a look this neutral, you can basically pair any lipstick you want with it. You can do a nude, you can do just something that's like not a nude, but like not super crazy, or you can do something super crazy, which is what I'm doing today. I'm gonna be going in with the Jeffree Star Velour Liquid Lipstick in the shade Candy Ass. It's metallic, it's beautiful, and I absolutely love it. It's sure to turn heads, shock the bitches at school. You're there all day, you wanna just kill it. These smell like strawberries, and they're absolutely delicious. Oh my lord! Boom, and there we go. Alrighty guys, the lips are on and they're so fun. It's something just very simple, but it's very effective too. And finally, we're gonna set our face and we're gonna be going in with the Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. <laughs> I just ate it. Alrighty guys, and this is the final look. Like I said, very simple, easy to do, not super time consuming, but y'all, oh so effective. The boys, the girls, everyone's gonna be shook to high heaven. But yeah guys, that's all I have for you today. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like and a comment and all that good stuff. Also subscribe if you have not already and turn on my post notifications so you can be notified every time that I release a new video. And also guys, um, just a quick little thing, I know I make jokes about school sucking, which I mean, it's not the best thing in the world, but um, it can be fun. So just make the best of it, stay in school, just get an education, be good students, don't piss people off, just be a good person, oh my gosh. I know summer's better, and that the last thing you really wanna do is sit in class all day, but you know what? It's life, we've all gotta do it, a lot of us have done it, so just, you know what? Roll with the punches, make the best of it. It'll be over soon, here in about like, I don't know, nine months, and you'll have summer again, and it's just one step closer to doing what you want with your life. But yeah, enough of that little motivational pep talk or whatever, but seriously, I mean it. But anyways, that's all I have for you guys, and I really hope you enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye guys.